Welcome to the fourth episode from the Federation of Multi Monitors. This episode features low altitude challenge from the Top Gun Maverick DLC, as flown on triple monitors running the SIM Update 10 beta. This update has finally provided basic support for multiple monitors. This is after almost two years of begging and pleading from like minded folks like myself and you. Now, look at the left monitor. You are seeing a shadow of the jet on the water with cockpit reflection of the sky from your three o'clock superimposed. Let me rewind and show you a fleeting glimpse that you might have missed. Now, watch the left monitor. That's ghost flying past me. As I fly higher away from the water, my jet's reflection separates from my plane. Look at the reflection of ghost on my clear cockpit bubble. A top objective of this challenge is to fly low, very low, as low as you can, without crashing. I can't imagine any other way to fly this challenge than to fly the jet with three monitors. I can fly sideways, knife edge style, and still get good visual indication of my relative height to the ground without ever looking at any gauge. Peripheral vision from the two side monitors afford me situation awareness. See how the banks of river flying past me continue to be visible outside of the center monitor. This is an experience one does not get with a single monitor and also not with VR, at least not with today's limited field of view shown in VR headsets. Just ask yourself, when you sit in the cockpit of an F-18, I mean a real one, is your peripheral vision cut off beyond a 90 degree field of view? Of course not. That would be ridiculous. I can't say that I'm playing this challenge well. I'm only trying to track low, keep the ground in a side view, and not fly too far, of course, such that I lose track of the target marker. Look at the top of the center monitor. A marker showing ghost is coming up. Originally, I intended to record an attempt at stalking ghost, but that turned out to be extremely difficult at this jet speed. Even triple monitors and track IR could not help me. I don't fly as fast as ghost, nor have I found a better route with just a few attempts to fly this course. But boy, am I having fun at last. Now that the geometric distortions on side monitors are gone. I'll shut up for a while. Now, watch and listen. It looks like we are closing in on the target. I think I need to go invert it any moment now. I'm probably botching this glorious moment of the entire mission. I'm too afraid to pull on the stick to fly close to the treetop. Oh well, at least I crossed the finish line. As for you, uh, you have again wasted one Top Gun training lap time. You just watched another useless episode from your favorite people, the Federation of Multi-Monitors.